but I love training with people that I met. I hit it in training a lot, and then people started to figure out what I was doing all the time, so they tried to stop it. But whenever I go and train with new people, like they always love this one. Um, cupping, I'm going to bend to Ashi. And now this one's going to, it's still going to come over, but it's going to go on bottom here. Okay? This is basically that position that we were in earlier. Sorry. It's basically that same position we were earlier with the double underhooks, right? So, Ashi, leg comes under. I'm going to scoot him forward by straightening this leg. Boom. Now bring his leg to me, catch it. <laughs> it's, it's easy. Not the first hundred times. So rest it. If you uh, if you hold on to the straight ankle, you'll end up in that um, Texas clover or whatever they call it. But if you reach for the leg, then you won't have that. You'll just have double leg control, which is fine. Um, I don't actually finish people from that Texas clover that often. It's not my thing. Boom. Just get a good rep of getting up. Drop back down. This one comes underneath. And my foot goes in front. I'm going to straighten this leg. This leg kind of posts against his thigh so that he can't scoot forward. And he can't scoot forward with this leg because I have it here. So I kind of kick forward. Use my leg to straighten it out. Boom. Boom. Drop him down. Now from here, you could do like your Texas Clover stuff. I don't like that type of stuff. I'm not really that good at it. So I'll just pass his leg over. You don't, you don't finish the uh, Clover? Yeah, because they're, they're just tough and you don't get the right time. I don't know. I just, I put my, like, I think it's all about reps. And I just don't put reps into that. If we I'm sure, like, if I got with my teammates and we were like, we're going to learn this, we would get good at it. but. Um, yeah, just to, whenever it comes to like time, I'd rather not work on that position. Um, here, here, bump him. So now this could be what you end up in. I didn't grab that bottom leg at all. And I'm just here. Now I'm going to pass this one over. Finish. One thing that might happen. If I'm here, I could switch this hand across. This is an alternate finish that we use. You could finish him here, but since I'm not controlling his leg, it's probably not going to happen. Push it out of the way. If you still, like, if this guy's really tough, I would go with what we just call the alternate grip. I switch this hand across, catch his heel right here, bring my bicep in, and then I just drop my shoulder down this way. One more time. Okay guys, let's go.